welcome back to my channel. It's Bailey, and in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys um, the best way to get um, star coins and your big shillings. Now, I know that you cannot get, you can't earn star coins, but I do have another way, and I'll show you guys in a minute. But before we get started with today's video, I just wanted to say thank you all so much for 32 subscribers. Thank you all so much. Um, I appreciate it. I think there was somebody that does art that subscribed to my channel, so thank you so much. Um, I don't really know the full name of your channel, but, um, I know it said art in it. And one of my, one of my mom's relatives subscribed to my channel in the, never mind. But without further ado, let's go ahead and get right into the video. Okay, so the best way to get your your work shillings for me in Star Stable would have to be doing quests or just doing a race. I know that is easy to do. And you can also do your reputation to get more quests because I've been running low on quests to do. And I did get a new quest today, but it was really short and I wish I'd get something long but like takes me forever because I miss doing those kinds of things. But I've been trying to complete most of my side quests and here's why. Let me show you. If you look up here, I used to be a star rider. I did video, I was deleted, but um, this is my main quest. Flower for the cupcakes, silver gland, I am not a star rider, which means I can't do it. I've been trying to um, convince my dad to let me get star rider, but he keeps saying no. And I'm thinking maybe I'll ask for my birthday because my birthday is coming up because um, my birthday is in October, if you guys don't know. Do you have a quest that I can do, James? I finally finished that Token Tours quest. I finally finished it yesterday. I was very happy that I finally finished it. I've been trying to finish it for months now, and I finally did it. But you can compete in quests, or actually, you can do quests to earn your big shillings, and you can also do, um, you can also train, that also helps too, see, as you can see, you can get 20 your big shillings, and then some XP, the only thing is, it's a pain in the butt to get your character to level 7, I have been trying non-stop, I can't get to level 7, but I do know that I can do my training at Moreland, so we're gonna go there. The only two places I can go are the main, like, Moreland Stables and then the Fort Pinta. I finally... And I can also go to Jorvik City Mall. That, those are the only places I can go. I wish I had more because I want to do those fun videos that I see all over YouTube. I see... A lot of people finding a lot of horseshoes, and there are no more horseshoes in Moreland, like the actual, like, Moreland Fort Penta. I've looked, I can't find any, and I'm getting really frustrated, so I kind of, I kind of want to give up, but I don't really want to, though. I don't know what else to do, because I'm not allowed to go over there, I, I just don't know what else to do. And I didn't know what to do for today's video, well, technically... It's, I'm making this on a Sunday, but I'm posting this on a Tuesday since I missed my posting day. For Friday, I decided I'm just going to post this today, because why not? That's the birthday. Also, if you see a little bunny popping out of my little bag, um, it's a bunny that I got from the 10th birthday Everybody gets it when you log in on the 17th. If you missed it, if you're not here for the 10th anniversary, you won't be able to get it. Um, but you do have a chance to get it the day after. So I just wanted to say that. But there's so many people that have quests for me to do that I cannot do. Because I'm not at the right level, which is really annoying. So I'm just going to be doing training, trying to get my coins up my yorba chillings as you can see you can earn 20 i won glasses um from doing the token tours quest and that's why i'm wearing them but we're gonna do the race and then we're gonna do the jumping and then 
Um, I'm sorry that my videos are kind of all over the place. All over the place. I just don't really know what to talk about in my videos. Um, but after we do the training, and well, not really training, because I figured out that you cannot train your horse unless you have silver gland, and I do not. I mean, I'm allowed to go there, but I can't anymore because I'm my free star riders app. So, we're just doing this right now. But, um, after we, after I show you guys ways to get your over shillings, I'll show you ways to get star coins. And I don't know if it really works, um, but I will show you guys. Okay, so we broke that in like 55. My best record was 53, and I'm not good at completing these races. I'm just not good at it. Well done, Gabrielle. Yeah, my, my character's name is Gabrielle Clover Rain. That's not my real name, but that's the name of the character, so... I don't think I want to do the race again. I think I want to work on my jumping, because Chip needs to work on it. I'm not, I wasn't very good at making Star Stable videos before, that's a little zoomed in too much, but now I'm kind of a little bit better. I got you guys, I don't know if you guys can see everything, I hope you can, it looks like it, because I watched one of my Star Stable videos back and it was really bad quality, so I decided to make my own tripod and use um, a box, and I'm, you guys are being held on a box, but... As long as you guys can see what's going on on the screen, that's all I care about. I'm watching. We completed the race in 35 seconds or maybe minutes. I don't know. I'm not really good at math. I don't think anybody is. I completed all of the birthday quizzes. I did all of those. I have all my prizes for that, but I do not have all my presents for the horseshoes because I don't have any other places to get horseshoes. Another fun lesson. Yes, Chip is getting much better. Are you kidding me? Is she talking to me? I don't know who she's talking to. She might be talking to my horse. I have a friend named... No, I don't. Okay, whatever. Um, I can't believe that. My horse went up a level 7. That is not fair that my horse is at a higher level than me. Dang it. I'm gonna have to up my game. Because I cannot have Chip at the same level as me. One of my friends in Star Stable, I told there was a horse that kind of looked like Chip. And my friend said, Chips are flat. Well, I never told her that I named my horse Chip. I'm not good at naming pets in games, but Chip Ace is her name. I also have, I only have two horses, and that is the, my second horse is the free birthday horse, and her name is Joy. Well, actually, her full name's Coral Joy, but I call her Joy because I like the name better. I don't know why I named her Coral. Dang it, I almost knocked down my camera. Okay, we finished that, and, again, she's getting all the XP, and I'm not getting nothing. I literally have nothing. This is how far I've gotten. I'm trying to get this. It's really hard, though, because I, I can't really stay on the track. It's really annoying. They say the best way to get more quests is to do your reputation, but I... It's really hard to do them. It's really a pain in the neck. Like, I watched a girl do hers, and some of them are really complicated to do. I'm trying my best to get them, but it's hard. Like, I heard there is the treasure quest, which is why I want Star Rider, so I can do... James's treasure quest. I'm really interested to see how that quest would work for me because I like quests that are like really long but not like I don't want like a limit of a quest. I want the quest to stay there forever, something that I can do um 
when I have nothing else to do in Star Stable, so. This video is 10 minutes long, so in a little bit, I'll show you guys how you can get star coins. I do know that you get star coins when you first start Star Stable. I did have a couple when I first started, but I spent them, and I don't know what I spent them on. It's really hard to remember. It was definitely not a clothing item, because I, I don't know, I don't really remember what I spent it on, but I know it was really dumb to spend it on. Chip, you missed it. Oh, dang it. Okay, turn back. We're going to have to start over. That was bad. I have to stay focused, that way I don't miss that again. And when I had free Star Rider, I was able to go to the castle I saw in the inside, and I wish I could go back there so I could complete quests that I need to finish. My main quest is the flower for the cupcakes. Even when I did have a Star Rider, I didn't understand what to do. So if you guys know how to do that, Please message me on Instagram and tell me how. Also, if you don't already know, I have a Snapchat. I don't post that much on it, but if you feel free to follow it, um, it's called Gaming with Bailey hashtag Adopt Me Life. The same thing it is it is on YouTube. Also, thank you guys so much for 76, 76 followers on um, Instagram. Thank you very much. I was going to do uh, reacting to um, my followers' videos, but I decided not to um, because I just didn't really feel like doing that. I kind of felt like doing this today, so yeah. Dang it, I'm never going to get the gold star. Okay, I think now I'm going to show you guys um, ways to get star coins. But first, um, these are all the quests that I need to do. As you can see, the happy birthday thing is still there. And something I do not get, and I need you guys to tell me um, this... I know that you can take Madison and the other person for a free ride as one of the quests for the birthday celebration, but something that is really weird is when I watch other people play it, um, it didn't show for me. Like, it didn't show that I could do that quest. It only showed, like, the happy birthday quest. So what I'm thinking is it might be because... I need to complete the happy birthday horseshoe hunt, but I can't, so I don't know what I'm going to do. I don't think I'll be able to participate in the Madison's free ride. I want to, but I don't think I can. But anyway, um, we're going to move on, and I'm going to show you guys ways to um, get star coins. So let's go over to the place where I'm going to show you. Okay, so I had to switch recording because I'm recording on my phone now, but I'll make sure I cut this part into the video. Hang on. Okay, sorry about that. I was just talking to somebody on Star Stable, and sorry for the background noise, but I'm going to show you guys. So I have these two apps called Cash Alarm and Scratch Cash. Now, the thing about these are Scratch Cash, it doesn't actually give you real money. It gives you coins that go into this app. Now, when you have enough... I'm still working on mine, but I'm going to obviously spend it all on Star Stable because I don't think you can buy Star Rider with um, a Google Play card. I think I've already tried that and it doesn't work. I have 500 and, well, 5,366 coins. Now, you can play games 
to earn more and I play this you basically just scratch cards and it gives you a couple of coins and then they transfer into your account so that way you can get more and then when you go here when you are ready to buy a card I think it takes like three d business days to come to your email or actually come to your account so this is how much it costs it costs nine thousand well maybe ninety three thousand a hundred and eighteen that is a lot um but i will try to get it the only thing i can afford is paypal and i don't know if i would buy it because my dad would probably get really mad at me if i did buy it because i'm not allowed to buy paypal and stuff like that by myself but those are also ways you can earn you can get a google play card to get some star coins I'm probably going to buy a lot of them, so that way I can do um, some things like train my horse and do stuff like that. But that is also another way. And I also have another app. Um, it's Misplay. I know everybody probably uses this app. I don't have enough. I did buy one a couple days ago. Another Google Play card. That's why I'm broke. Uh, but I spent it on Roblox. Actually, no, I had a Google Play card last year, no, last month, and I spent it on my Tokoboka and my games and stuff because I was so into that game, and now I'm into Star Staples, so now we're doing this. But the only one I could afford was this one, so I'd recommend buying this one first, and then if you want, you could obviously buy this one. I'm pretty far at buying one of these, like an Amazon card, but... I think I'm just going to stick to my misplay and cash alarm instead of, well, using a credit card to buy star coins. I've never spent money on Star Stable before. I'm really excited to get star coins in my account so that I can start buying things. But, um, yeah, so that is ways you can get, also get star coins. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and if you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up. And I gotta go, because I'm gonna, my, my friend is waiting, I told her I'd be AFK. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I will see you guys next time. Bye!